Hello everybody, Alex here from Snake on Exotics. There was no video yesterday because my phone broke. So I spent most of the day trying to get it fixed. So well, we have a completely new screen and everything today because it just broke. It just started doing all crazy things and stuff. Didn't drop it, didn't smash it, didn't nothing. So I had to get a new phone, so that's all sorted now. But we need updates today. So I'm afraid we've got a sad update about the axolotls. It's a bit, I don't know what's gone wrong there. Um, we can do an update on um, Atlas because I've had quite a few people asking about him. So we're going to do an update on Atlas. Uh, we'll go around, we'll see about the holiday animals and stuff like that. We do have a midweek feeding we've got to do today. Um, two, we've got to do the rainbow boa and we've got to do the holiday royal. So we're going to do them as well. So please like, subscribe, comment, and share, ring the bell for me. Let's crack on with the day. Wah ha ha. Okay, so the axolotls. Bit sad, bit sad. So came in yesterday and I'd had about half pass away. Um, what I'd, I think what had happened is the air stone in there was that strong, <coughs> the flow, it, it, it started a vacuum. So the force of the bubbles going up was forcing the water away and then the bubbles going up again was making more will go up. So it was making a little cycle and drawing a lot of the weaker ones to it. Um, so I had a big pile of, I don't know if it's, they died because of that or their bodies just got brought towards it. So I had that. So I raised that up in the air so that physically couldn't happen again. Um, did a water change, cleaned out everybody. And then today, the other half's gone. So we don't think we have anybody left at all. So I think those ones down there are just going round with the flow. But I haven't seen a wiggle. I haven't seen anything. So I think we've lost everybody now. So, what could have happened? Um, we could have just had a bad batch of eggs. So, when a lot of these animals are laying their first batch of eggs, sometimes they're not very good. Uh, and it takes a couple of seasons of them laying eggs for them to lay actually a good successful bunch. Um, so that's a possibility. Um, there's plenty of air. We was feeding them the right food. We was doing the water changes. I mean, the water's fine, I've tested it. There's no filter, but there was, wasn't very much of a bio load. Um, so we've been doing the water changes as we did. Uh, the only difference this time than we did from last time, oh, gotta bless me arm a sec, sorry. The other way we did it differently was we had them in groups of 10. So we had about 20, I think it was um, Chinese food containers and uh, we had 10 in each one so that's the only thing we did different is we had them all in separate ones with less water we had 10 times more water uh, and we had everybody in one big group so maybe next time we'll go back to step keeping them in groups of 10 um, I think then if we had any dyes off or anything or have anything affect the water, it would affect the smaller bunches and we wouldn't have the mass die offs. Possibly. So um, I'm going to close that down later on today. Um, but yeah, bit of a shame. Hmm, maybe next time. I've got the food to frost in. So we'll uh, go around and feed them. So we're feeding James's Royal first. So. Uh, Hopefully you'll feed for us today. He's having a little medium. So, uh, let's see how we get on. Okay, I'm just getting used to this. It's for some reason, it's a bit new and I'm getting really white flares and stuff blowing off the cameras, off the lights. So, please bear with me because I've got to change the settings, I think. So what we're gonna do, <laughs> we've got James's Royal here. I've lost the keys, so I'll go behind the keys and we'll give the This should be nice and warm for him. Woo! Can't see any movement. Come on, buddy, he's right deep in that cave. He is right deep. Oh, 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 there's movement. There's movement. That's a good sign. You might be able to smell it. I don't see a head yet. Hmm. 
not looking very promising. Okay, I'm going to see if I can balance you here. Stay. Oh, she said. Hey. Nah, she's not going to feed. But she has shed for us. So uh, I'm going to have to double check that. Go through it all. Make sure it's all good. Oh, okay. It's like a full shed, but just broken as she's taking it off. So <laughs> let's see how Mr. Rainbow is going to do. Mr. Rainbow. Ooh, we got that one. Good lad. We give the last one to Snappos. He's always all good. Snappy. Are you wanting munchies? Oh, good lad. That went as well as expected. Oh, I didn't think James and little ones can eat. Little ones, they take moving and, and stuff like that really, really deeply. They do. So it can take them a long time to settle in. When <coughs> the big snakes, they can take a lot of it on their chin after a while, especially once they've done it a couple of times. I mean, the rainbow bar has been here three or four times now, so she's used to it all now. So now, Atlas, he is still kicking. He is, he is still kicking. He's asleep at the moment. My voice will probably wake him up in a sec. He's still kicking, he's doing well. He's hanging in there. He has his good days and his bad days, basically. Um, so, I am happy with him. Um, it's just he is getting skinnier and skinnier over time. We're trying our best. We're trying our best. We're getting in the calcium and everything. Um, I'm about to dunk these ones in this now. So, um, let's see if he's hungry. I might have to wake him up. Though. Hey! As you can see, he's still very skinny. Very skinny. Are you hungry, bud? Thinking about it. And plonk. He's got it. He struggles a little bit because his tongue doesn't work very well anymore. Poor Atlas. But he's still whacking out the colours. Look at him. But he just can't hold the weight anymore. He's really struggling. He's just an old man, now, aren't you, mate? That's what it is. Oh, man. So I let him eat that one. And then we'll give him a. As many as he'll eat, and then we'll, uh, we'll leave him alone for the day. So we don't mess with him anymore. He just lives his life out happily, chilling in the in the shop now. I don't stress. We don't get him out and do anything with him really, um, just because I don't want to stress him out. And he's very weak, so I don't want him to overexert himself and then have it a bad turn. So we try to keep him as healthy and as happy as he is. Um, we try not to mess with him anymore. Um, we just let him live his life out in retirement. Another one? Yeah? No, maybe? He's thinking about it. When he opens his mouth, I normally just chuck it in. So he can eat it a lot easier. There he goes, I missed that. Look at that, chompy chomps. There you go mate, what a good lad. What a good lad. Good boy, good boy. Like, subscribe, comment, share, ring the bell for me if you haven't already. If you want to watch another video, there should be one down there. If you want to subscribe to the channel, it lives up there. If you want to watch the playlist, it's up there. Apart from that, we'll see you in the future. Bye!